to a point where it feels completely life and death, that say touching a bin, for example, that's because of how your brain has learned to recognize it. There is no easy way around that. And there are going to be times where you're going to have to white knuckle it like on a roller coaster and go for it because there's no, you can't have gradual progression. And people will say that is, that is, uh, there must be some easier way. There isn't at certain points. There is no gradual progression. You will have to take the leap at certain points. So that is so, so crucial. There will be tons of therapists out there that will, will try and make it slower and slower. And the progression could take years for that person to get better. Instead of, you can actually make that progress when you really take leaps. I've seen people take massive leaps early on in their journey because they've, they've come to me and they've said, you know, I really want to do this now, Rob. I'm fed up of living like this. And I've seen people go and make the biggest moves possible. But you've got to, you, you've got to face those fears. If, if, if you're... If there's something that's holding you back, ask yourself, is this the life I want to live? And when I'm 90, looking back at my life, and I look back at my life and look at a period of number of years of having OCD, will I look back and go, I gave it my all, that's the way I wanted to spend that time that I've got on this rock floating throughout space, that, that little bit of time that, I've, that we've got on this, on this earth, I wanted to spend it all the time held back by that. I completely understand 100% the difficulty, the challenge in doing those exposures. I know it from my own experience, putting it off, putting it off, putting it off, waiting to be comfortable. Comfortable doesn't come. You have to, at a point, go for it. There is no other way.